counties in Arizona, including Yuma County. Arizona Governor Doug Ducey says it's because that money needs to be used for other things. But residents in Phoenix and Tucson got more money per per resident, that is, compared to Yuma County. So News 11's Crystal Jimenez took a deeper look to explain. The Yuma County community has been hit hard by the coronavirus pandemic, with cases this month hitting over 100 on average. So when state officials that represent the Yuma County learned that we were being shortchanged from CARES Act funds, they decided to do something about it. The CARES Act, distributed by Congress for cities to use towards first responders to help the homeless or those whose lives were turned upside down when the pandemic hit. Larger cities received the CARES Act funds directly, but in smaller parts of the state like Yuma County, funds were sent to the governor's office to be distributed, and small cities weren't given their fair share of the distribution. It's disappointing to have the state government not understand that some areas feel the impact much more than others and, and to focus on the level of need instead of the size of the community. Wednesday, Governor Ducey stated that a formula from the Department of Treasury was used to allocate the funds. But when asked why this formula wasn't used for smaller cities... It was left to the, uh, to the discretion of the governor. Smaller cities were shortchanged from $174 per person to $115. Because we have additional needs for those dollars. We've reached out to Ducey for further comment but have not heard back. Representative Charlene Fernandez believes that as the number of COVID-19 cases in Yuma County continues to rise, those funds taken away could make an impact locally. I think we're getting hit harder because we don't have the resources. If anything, we need more money in the outlying areas in the smaller cities.